the Apple Air Power is coming this year in 2019. It was rumored to be released back in 2018 and it was announced at the same time as the iPhone X back in 2017, but we never really saw it come to life. Now, there's a couple of reasons why. First being, technologically, it's very difficult to do what they were claiming mm -hmm. they wanted to do. So the goal of the AirPad was to charge three devices separately on one single pad. And that's very hard to do. There's a bunch of issues with a whole current and voltage situation. You don't want it to overheat or overcharge certain devices. And it's not just that they wanted to charge three devices at once. It was they wanted to charge three devices by placing them anywhere on the pad. That was a difficult thing. And to rectify this, they're gonna have 22 wireless coils that will have power supplied to each individual coil, mm -hmm. allowing you to place your phone maybe on the left corner or wherever you place it, and it's still getting a charge. Now, this is very different to what we see now. Samsung does have a solution to it, but it has two separate charging pads in one body. So it's not the same thing that Apple's going for. Mm -hmm. This is completely different, which is why it's taken them two years to release it. It's rumored to be coming out alongside of the AirPods 2 this month at the end of March, which is super exciting. The AirPods 2 do feature that wireless charging capability. Mm -hmm. And that's the reason why we think it's going to come out with the AirPods 2, because they are going to be featured as a wireless charger. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't make sense for Apple to release this feature if they didn't have a product that would enable that. No, and it's also good for marketing. Wireless charging for your wireless AirPods and your phone mm -hmm. and watch, if you're balling, at the same time. Another reason that we think it's going to be coming out this year or early 2019 is because in 2018 in December, Steve Trotton Smith tweeted that Apple has fixed the issues that they are having and that they should be available. In addition, Ming Chi Ku tweeted mm. that the Air Power product should start shipping and be available in the first half of 2018. So we're really, sorry, of 2019. So we're really hoping that March 29th, when the AirPods 2 are rumored to be released and available, mm -hmm. that the Air Powers will also be released. Now, the big question is, Nathan, does it come in black? I don't think so. No? Mm. There isn't really anything been confirmed yet, but what we do know, and this is, this is dating back to 2017 when they first announced it, it's gonna look like basically a large white mat with a, a power source coming out of it. That's the only really rumors or information we have on it right now. Mm. Regardless of, regarding color, I doubt they're gonna have a black option, but maybe since it's rumored that the AirPods 2 are gonna come in a black option, they might have a black option for the Air Power as well. Yeah, you never know. It'll look pretty cool. The Air Power is also rumored to have a custom iOS chip that will allow the devices to communicate with each other and also offer power management. So what that means is when you have an iPhone and uh, Apple Watch and your AirPods on the device, the Air Power will decide if the iPhone needs more power or maybe the AirPods need more power. It will make that decision. Additionally, mm. it will communicate with the three devices on the iPhone. So if your iPhone is charging, you will be able to see the charging status of your iPhone, obviously, and the AirPods and the Apple Watch at the same time while it's on the map. But if you take it off, you won't have that capabilities. Well, these were all the rumors that we had for the Air Power. If you guys want us to see anything or look in anything, let us know in the comments below. And subscribe if you're new.